Hi. So I was talking about, um, yeah, I got a call from Trent Reznor's manager and he uh, did not seem happy with me and said that I would be getting a call from Trent himself very soon. So I was kind of on pins and needles. And, and in the meantime, ironically, I had been communicating with Charlie Clouser, who was in Nine Inch Nails, and he was like, I think he played Keys or something like that. We had the same publisher. It worked out that we were going to try and get together and write a couple tracks or something like that. And it, it just was a coincidence. But I had been talking to Charlie, and I could tell his voice. And so the phone rings, and he's like, hello, um... Is Stella there? And I'm like, oh, hi, Charlie. He's like, no, this is not Charlie. This is Trent Reznor. And as he said that, I stood up at the table and knocked over a gallon of open milk. And milk was spilling out everywhere on the table onto the floors. And uh, I was panicking as the milk was on the floor. And I just coolly said, oh, hello, Trent. And um, and he's like, you know, usually when people mess around with my music, I get really pissed. He said, but I was pleasantly surprised. And I was like, oh, he likes it. Oh, my God. And he's like, do you want to come to New Orleans and I'll produce it, we'll recut it, and I'll produce it. And I said, yes. And I went to New Orleans and I worked with him for four days, three or four days. And it was one of the best experiences of my life. I mean, and on top of it, he was like the nicest guy ever. He was like so totally nice and, and gentlemanly and just like kind of Southern charm you know <laughs> and um yeah it was it was awesome and I felt like okay now I have this track and I did this with my hero you know and now I can go into this whole pop thing and when I start to question myself about selling out and completely destroying myself as an artist or any credibility that I might have had I could just always hold up this track to myself and say, yeah, but you know what? This is who you really are, and this is what you really can do. And that's what that track did for me. I mean, it gave me the strength and, um, you know, the willpower to go into completely uncharted territory for me. It's something I didn't want to do, and just it gave me the strength to do it. And so... That's how that worked out. <laughs>